Okay, so here's how to make textures in Nomad Sculpt, or how to add textures. Like this here, and I'm going to use Procreate to make the texture. So let's start off fresh. So I'm going to make a new, I'm going to make a square. 3,000 by 3,000 pixels, and we'll set the background to black, and on a new layer, we'll go to our brush, and so I will try, let's see, so let's try this, this looks nice. Okay, so I'm going to make the brush as big as possible. And let's see if I can make it bigger in the settings. Just change it to maximum size. So now it should color off. There we go, that's, a, that's easier. All right, so now I've colored everything here, and I'm just going to save this image. And you can use any image, any texture. Um, and we can do another one just so, just to try something different. So now I've set a new layer, and we'll use rough skin. Okay, rough skin looks good. So I'm going to click on the brush and just make the, do the same thing. I'll go to properties and just make the maximum brush size bigger. That way it's easier to cover the whole. And we'll see how this looks. It does have a bit of a pattern, so we'll have to see how that looks. But we'll save it as a JPEG. Okay, so now we should have these two, these last two images that we made. This one and this one. Okay, so once we have our squares, we can go into Nomad. And here we have my snail, but I'll just make a new shape. So we can start from scratch. I'll just solo this. So we have one new shape here. I'm going to validate. And it's pretty low um, resolution. So I'm going to duplicate it. And I'll slide this one over here. I'll just put it next to it. So now we have the two. And for this one, subdivide it, subdivide it. So this one is nice and clear. This one is low resolution. And that's just so we can see the difference. I'll move my light over so it kind of hits both of them. There we go. Okay. So in order to use our texture, we're going to use the clay tool. And we want to go over to this little pencil right here. And so here we have our options, and we're gonna, we want to go to Alpha. So we just want to hit this little plus, and then we'll go to Photos. And then we'll use our first image, Add. And the image shows up here. Okay. 
So we're in our clay tool and we'll put the intensity up too high. We'll bring the brush down a little bit and let's see what happens. I don't want to color yet. So let's see. So I'm going to uncheck stroke painting. That way there's no color. So now I'm just going to color on the first sphere. And let's see what it looks like if we subdivide it. So here's what it looks like if we sub. It kind of looks like a golf ball. Now let's use the same one on the on this sphere. So as you can see that it does a very different look when the shape is more detailed. Let's add some more light to this guy. Let me hide my lights. Okay, so another thing that I always do when I'm adding textures, so let's say I want to add it to the sphere. I'll go up here to the layers and I'll add layer. So I've added the layer, I'm, I'm back in my clay tool. I'm going to turn the intensity up. So now we've made this, we think we like it, but you're not sure. So now you can just hit the little eye on that layer. You can add a new layer. And we can actually try our other tool. So I'm going to hit plus again, photos, and we'll choose our second shape. Add. Okay, and now it's selected. So we're still in clay. Let's see what this looks like. So this actually might be nice for my snail. Now let's see what it looks like on this on this shape. They pretty much look the same on the low opacity, so good to know. So I'm going to get rid of this one, because I don't think I did it on a layer, which I should have, but that's okay. So I'll just delete this sphere, make a new one. Oops. Bring it up. And then I'll just... Make it a little clearer. So now I'm going to add a layer. And we're going to try another option that I've been messing around with. So down here you see surface and screen project. So let's do screen project. So there's a bit of a, a stroke or a pattern going on. Let's see if I can figure what that uh, what that is. Let's try the, the other brush. So it might have just been that brush. Wow, this looks like a dragon egg. So let's make a new layer, and then we'll add with, with color. So let's say we wanted to, we'll make it a glossy purple. So 
So now we're going to be painting. Let me make sure this is okay. So now we're going to be painting and it's going to be whatever color we picked here. Let's change the color of this. And for my snail, I was using, I think I used this one, which I made in Procreate. Yeah. That was a nice skin. Let's change the, um, let's make it so it's a little bit rougher. And I made this one in Procreate using Skin Details Flicks. That's what it was. So that's how I made that one. All right, hope that helps. Keep drawing. I will catch you guys in the next video. Mm -hmm.